up my folks all right the weigh-ins in i figured i'll drop a little video before it, uh, it gets too dark all right first of all i want to congratulate Corey and the team uh down in florida they they did a great job they uh not only broke a new record on the heaviest stringer a thousand eight pounds um they got third biggest bar um and just did an outstanding hunt every hog was over 300 pounds i think their big hog was 358 um so they were right up in that range you know right at 325 350 and uh you know just did a great job the difference in florida and here now the hunt this weekend we had we had rooting for old jp and uh the coles they uh you know i root for the guys that that feed my dogs you know what i'm saying the guys that use my stock that's who i'm and that was a that was a great hunt this was now the the difference in the florida hunts and the the hunt up here the florida hunt uh you can travel with live hogs they do it the way in they're actually still tied and alive here they have to it's a state law they have to uh they have to kill them so you're going to lose a little weight you know from bleeding out and everything like that too so um little size but you know it is what it is it's still a great competition great contest uh up here the 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 contest is through this region the delta region it's it's a real tough hunt them boys are hunting on that river uh thank god that no one lost their life this year and uh that's a real tough hunt on men and animals um you know and everyone made it out going back home to their family after the hunt but uh uh yeah cory won the championship and then JP placed third in this Delta hunt, which is a extremely hard hunt. Um, like, you know, like yesterday they were jamming. I think they caught 15 hogs yesterday. And the real, uh, the real uh, beauty of this is the a week before he comes up to me, he's like, man, we need another catch dog for the team because uh, uh, we're running low. And same thing with Corey. We're just running out of dogs, you know what I'm saying? And um, so I, I gave Dirty Face... To him to you you know to hunt with and uh he uh <laughs> only got to take her out one time the week before competition put her on two hogs that was her schooling okay yesterday the morning hunt that's just how tough it is i mean they're hunting out of a boat the, everything's tough the trip's tough the you know you, you're jumping out of the fucking boat titty deep in water pulling it up into the bushes climbing up rid mud ridges and clay ridges just to get onto the ridge to fucking throw the dog you know it's just a hard hunt and right off the rip they lost a the bulldog in the yesterday morning so then they're down you know you never just take one bulldog you're taking three four sometimes you know that that you can use because that's the kind of shit that happens and uh so then you're in so yeah we're real impressed that uh old dirty face uh really really uh come along and and pulled her weight this time I'm, I'm real pleased with her you know and it's hard when you you know because you're going after the big i think the smaller hogs that they caught were over 200 you know the river hogs and down there in florida is kind of different florida is a uh, it's world class where they are you know it's hog hunting is a little different sport because you got to have the land to hunt on uh you know and then boys take it very very seriously these teams are very serious they they feed these hogs and worm these hogs they 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 take care of these some bitches they don't you know they want them as big and nasty as big as teeth and as rough as they can possibly be you know for these competitions you know what i mean so it's it's something that that's a lot of fore planning goes in it and um it's it's a very fun thing i, I wish they could figure out a way to do online gambling on it make it more popular <laughs> you know what i'm saying but uh yeah, I'm just I'm excited that my boys are uh, are up in the in the bracket this year already, and uh, I'm really excited that uh Corey got to break a record and and do all that. And and it's proven a point that, that I've been trying to tell these people that nothing beats the game dog for a catch dog, okay? All these other guys talking about well they can do this or they're just as good. They're not. They're, if, when the when the like I say, there's different levels to this shit. And the true fast lane hardcore, the game dog is the only one. That's the only one that, that, that can handle it day in, day out. I mean, that's how, like yesterday caught 15 hogs on a ridge. You know what I mean? The farthest they said was a thousand yards with bay. So that, that was the farthest. Most of them were like 50, 75 yards in, they said. So they're bang, 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 catching them back to back to back to back to back. And then get up this morning after being sewed up and stapled and fucked up and... You know, 
getting up this morning and get loaded right back on that bumpy ass boat traveling in that, that cold ass delta in the morning getting up in that mud in that cold water you know doing it all again today like i said it's real tough on men and dogs and there's only one dog that excels at it truthfully you know that it, the, their game dog is what is proving it i mean i don't even got to say it i'm they're proving it for me but anyway folks y'all take care y'all stay safe congratulations guys y'all keep on bulldogging i'm looking forward to the next one